Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So this channel, Everyday Data Science, is all about trying to learn the different concepts involved in data science by practicing a lot of questions. Okay, so in this video, I am going to solve this question on read code, which is based on not boring movies and try to walk you through how we can develop queries to such problems. Okay, so we are given a table called cinema, which has four different columns. ID, movie, description, and rating. And these are the data types of each of these columns. ID is the primary key for this table. Each row contains information about the name of the movie, its genre, and its rating. Okay. Rating is a two decimal places float in the range 0 to 10. So obviously, like the closer you are to the 10, the better the movie is. Now, we are asked to write a SQL query to report the movies with an odd numbered ID and a description that is not boring. Okay. Return the result table ordered by rating in descending order. So till now, all the questions that we did around 12 or 13, there the order of the result didn't matter. But here, the order of the result matters. Okay. So let's go through this example. So these, this, these are the five records that are given to us. So let's go step by step. Firstly, it says report the movies with an odd number ID. So obviously out of these five, the odd number IDs are one, three and five. Okay. Then it says, and a description that is not boring. So let's see if the description of one, three and five is boring or not. So great 3D, so not boring boring so we exclude this part and then for id equal to five interesting okay so now we have one and five so only first row and the last row and there and then we were uh, we want to return the result ordered by the rating in descending order so obviously out of 8.9 and 9.1 9.1 is more so first thing we need to return is this row and then this row and that should be the output right so five house card interesting 9.1 one war grade 3d 8.9 okay so let's follow this and uh, build the query step by step okay so from this table called cinema what do we need to do first report the movies with an odd number id okay where so that is keep only those records where id modular 2 so basically modular so uh, is it will divide the value in id column by 2 and see the uh, the remainder part of it so even numbers when divided by 2 leave a remainder of 0 and odd numbers leave a remainder of 1 okay so either you can write it as equal to one or you can write it as not equal to zero because if it is equal to zero then that id would be an even number and if it is not equal to zero it would be an odd number okay so you can write both let's go ahead with this part uh, and see how it works then we are also asked to do and a description that is not boring. Okay. So and description is not boring. Okay. And then we are to report the movies, right? So it is since it is not mentioned specific columns. And even in the output, you can see all the four columns that are mentioned in the table are present. So basically we need to return every column. So return or select star. Okay. Now the query is not complete yet because remember it also asks us to return the result table ordered by rating in descending order. Okay. So the final thing that we need to do is order by rating in descending order okay so now whatever was asked to us to do we have included that everything in the sql query let's go ahead and run and see what happens 
okay so it is accepted and our output is same as expected output let's go ahead and submit and see if it passes all the test cases or not so yeah it is it passes all the test cases so this is how we solve this problem remember if you feel overwhelmed by the amount of information given in the question just start with the table and follow step by step just do the first thing do the second thing try to say you and you have not missed something see what they want us to uh, to return and if we need to order by or if they want the result in a particular order then include that so yeah this is how this question was done and let me know if you guys found this video useful and i will see you guys in the next video